Hi there and welcome to Sheet Leveler. My name is Joanne and I'm here to make sure you can easily use Excel with the help of our video tutorials. Today, let's take a closer look at the Today function, which gives you the current date in day, month or year format. It's also useful for creating time ranges in a spreadsheet. Get ready to learn more in today's tutorial. The first thing we will show is how we can use the function Today to easily insert the current date into any spreadsheet. To enter the current date into a cell, select the cell and click into it. Then, type an equal sign followed by the word today. To use a function in Excel, simply select it from the suggested list, confirm it, add the closing bracket, then press enter. That's all it takes. The selected cell will display the current date. Excel recognized the cell contents as a date and automatically formatted it as such. If you'd like to adjust the date format to a version that is more convenient for you, simply take the following steps. Right-click on the cell, select Format Cells from the menu that appears, and then select the date format that you prefer. Click on OK. The Today function not only gives you the current date, but it also shows the day of the month in numerical form. To display the final value, click into the selected cell and type in the equal sign. We will then take a slightly different approach. We will begin by entering the day function. Within this function, we can take advantage of the option of nesting and include the today function. Using the day function in Excel, you can extract the day of the month from the current date, which is provided by the today function. We add the closing bracket of the function day to the end of the closing bracket of the function today. Now press the enter key and let's take a look at the results. The results we received were not in an understandable format this is not the desired outcome. To ensure the result is displayed in the correct format, select either General or Number from the cell formatting options. Click OK to confirm. Once the correct formatting is applied, Excel will display the information for the current day as a numerical value. This function displays the current month as a number, similar to how it displays the information for the month. Let's select the cell one more time, then type the equal sign followed by the month function. In this function, we will include the function today as a nested function. Using the today function in Excel, you can extract the current number of the month just like the current day was in our last example. We add the closing bracket of the function today to the end of the closing bracket of the function today. Now press the enter key and let's take a look at the results. The results we received were not in an understandable format, just like our last example. To ensure the result is displayed in the correct format, select either General or Number from the cell formatting options. Click OK to confirm. Once the correct formatting is applied, Excel will display the information for the current day as a numerical value. Now let's have a look at our final example. We can use this function to calculate the exact date a predetermined amount of days from now. This function can be used to determine the exact date 14 days from the current day. Although it may seem difficult, it is very easy to do. To calculate the date 14 days from today, start by selecting a cell in your spreadsheet and typing an equals then today and an open bracket. Next, add a plus sign followed by 14. This will give you the date 14 days from today. When you press enter, you will see the date that will be two weeks from today in the calendar. To learn how to subtract a number of days from a current date, or to calculate age using a date of birth, you can watch a separate video tutorial by Sheet Leveler. The link to the relevant videos can be found in the description below. If you found this tutorial useful, please show your appreciation by giving the video a like. If you are new to Sheet Leveler, if you would like to improve your Excel skills, hit the subscribe button and learn how to use Excel like a boss. I appreciate you taking the time to view my video. I look forward to seeing you in the next one.